will be picked up now by Ethan Lerman. Lerman out through neutralized. This is off. Pike drops it off the kill foil. It'll fire one right on. That'll be stopped by Ruccia. Liam Kilfoyles starting to pile up a few points here over the last little stretch. Roughed up in the corner by the rugged Eagles overage defenseman, Connor Shortled. St. John's Newfoundland native. Puck comes back to the line. There's a shot. Traffic in front. Oh, big save right there as Ruccia down. Sprawling out to deny Ethan Lerman point-blank opportunity for the Mooseheads overager. Nicholas Ruccia coming up. will shovel it in. Dominic McKenzie. Track it back after it, try to angle that one off the boards. Liam Welsh, a little bump there on the wall as that one squirts free. Milner making a big save. Reynolds trying to work it loose. Vinicek's in the middle there. It does pop free. McKinnon will play it off the end boards. Deep in the action, Xavier Day. He'll try to work that one around. It's centered out front. That one popping free. Out front, not a big chance there. The Moose will have to tag up as Schultz cuts back. Reynolds now will. Bank it back here for Catapor. He's across the red line for Schultz. Over to Reynolds. Back to Schultz here, center point. Schultz to Catapor. Walk it in down low. It's worked out front. Bit of check. Back to Catapor. A shot. They score. That's you, Catapor. It's going to open the scoring here in the first period. And the Mooseheads are up 1-0. Well, 23rd goal of the season here, and this the final game. Liam Kilfoyle's got another point, so that's seven points in the last seven for Kilfoyle. Bites throws it out front. Ah, oh, Liam Welsh looking skyward. Cannot believe that he could not find Twine right there. Great opportunity for Liam Welsh called up once again from the Churro Bearcats of the Maritime Junior A League. Three assists in 28 games last year for. Liam played to Connor Shortle. It's worked up top. Schultz across here for Kilfoyle. Kilfoyle trying to work it back across. That got broken up. And now hustling after it. Antoine Wah busting in. And Schultz reaching in. A great defensive play right there by the Mooseheads veteran blue liner Brady Schultz. as well as Phillips up ice. It's quite able to find the handle of that one. And the Eagles with an odd man rush the other way. McPhee rips one right on. Milner will sweep it a shot there for Patterson. And doesn't quite connect. This Catapor is able to work it up ice. Vinicek making his way. It takes a look, a shot. He's going to ring that one off the iron as Borovic tries to knock it back down the boards for Peter Reynolds, but that got broken up. Great opportunity right there. Catapor with a good stick. Good work from him, but he'll have it stripped away just inside that Cape Breton blue line. As Borovic is on the attack across the Patterson to the back end. Oh, knocked away. Milner down. Ah. Terrific stuff right there as the Eagles. Not close to tying it up. Jack Milner sprawling out. A piece of Olivier Hood on the attack. He's across the line for Cam McDonald. A shot. Antoine Fontaine blocking that one. Hood back in possession out here for Schmidt. Knocked over for Hood. Schmidt once again will throw it toward the net. Little redirect. The scramble there in front. Knocked away. Lincoln Wah at the line. A shot. They score. And that puck just lobbed on net through a sea of legs by Lincoln Wan, I believe. That is the Cape Breton Eagle rookie defenseman's second goal of the season. Just came back to that left point. Wah will just lob it on net. Up the left wing side, Squires going to chip that one in as Brady Schultz comes back to pick it up for the Moose. Now Moser handing off for McKinnon. McKinnon with some speed here down the right wing. Throws it toward the net. Bouncy Buck McPhee a chance. Ruccia down. A oh, big save right there as Ruccia knocking that one aside. Oh, terrific opportunity in tight. And Nicholas Ruccia has made some real nice saves here in this one. And Contest it right there. A couple of chances. He's slowing up along the half wall here on the right wing side. Angles it off the boards up top. Schultz, nifty move, dished off. Catafor in tight. Little chip in front there from Kilfoyle as he was trying to set up Reynolds. Back to Schultz. Let's it go. Little redirect there as Reynolds was battling in the slot area. 
And Amouche maintain control. Gattafort throws toward the net, banging away in front. They score. Liam Gilfoyle will knock it home on a midair of the Mouchad. Strike on the power play again. It's 2 1. And the Mouchad's rookie, Gilfoyle, he is going to stay hot here for the herd. 30 members of Gilfoyle's family in the building. Well, he's got his seven. Both guys picking up assists and the other's power play goal as the Eagles send this one in deep. Milner came out to play it, sent it up the right wing side. Olivier Hood looking to knock that one down. Finds himself in a battle with Larman. He breaks free, throws it over the slot area. Shot, they score. And it's Charles Antoine Lavalet just lobbing it on net on the backhand, and that one is going to sneak through past Jack Milner. And the Eagles will even it up at two. Going that one, kind of pinballs its way wide of the net off a couple of bodies, and now shoveled out by the Eagles. It's going to be batted down here by Squires. Squires down the right wing side, lets it go, and Milner. Lining up, pulls it back to Reynolds. He'll dish off McKinnon, walking in a shot. Ruccia snags that one, and he's going to hang on to it. So the Eagles can get their fresh legs out there. Big shit. Up ahead, puck will be chipped in by Patterson. Just about in the final minute. There's a minute 06 left in the clock. Patterson has it down here in the corner. He'll play it back in the net to Burbage. Going to spin off a his check. Took a bump there from McKinnon. It's worked up top to Schmidt. Schmidt will lob one. And that was blocked, Burbage knocks it in front, Burbage, he's got Milner down, a shot, he scores! And Cole Burbage, he'll roof that one, and the Eagles, for the first time here today, have got the lead. And there's going to be some discussion, I would think, about that. Milner, he was knocked over in front, there was a lot of traffic around him. Now hustling to the bench, it's Milner, extra attacker out, McDonald looking to clear it out, Kilfoyle got tripped up as he knocked that one down, net is empty, Fullerton at center, a shot, he scores, and Fullerton from neutral ice will look to ice this game for Cape Breton as he fires that one, right into that vacant Cape Welsh. Handing that one off, it's gonna be dumped in now by the Moose, and that is gonna do it. The Cape Breton Eagles victorious here today, and this is the final game of 2023.